And we're back with more action from the 2011 NWCA All-Star Classic here on FCS. And we're set to go here at 149 pounds, returning All-American Jamal Parks. Fifth place a year ago for the Cowboys. Again in that trademark Cowboy Orange. Going to take on Joel Smith, late replacement here. A redshirt freshman from Arizona State by way of Lawrenceville, Georgia. Collins Hill High School. While well, Parks quickly in on the shot. Gets control, going to get two. And gets dropped down to the mat, does Smith, and Parks going to drive Smith out of bounds. We'll restart. 2.32 to go here in period number one. Jamal Parks holding a 2-0 lead over Joel Smith. Smith a replacement for Tyler Nauman, who was supposed to wrestle in this match out of Pittsburgh. Not the first time the host school or a school close to the actions had to step up several years ago as Parks is looking for a turn and is getting the five count. So it looks like he's only got two there. Referee holding two. Parks that arm bar tilt, still trying to work. Drive the pressure over. Towards the edge, still inbounds. Out of bounds, there's two awarded, so now 4-0 for Parks. And as we were saying a couple years ago, when SIU Edwardsville hosted this tournament, or this event, uh, one of the wrestlers well, was a late scratch, and they called up co then coach Dave Grant at Northern Illinois a couple hours away in DeKalb and said, hey, you got anybody, <laughs> anybody can make it at 133? And they did, and that was Max Hyatt that stepped in. Northern Illinois, a couple hours away from SIUE. So Smith stepping up to the plate. A little outgunned here uh, against Parks, the veteran. Finally broke through with that All-American finish last year. A cardiac effort to get there. Front headlock now for Parks, snapping it down. Sean Charles and Brian Stiff in the corner for Smith. Stiff, a two-time All-American and NCAA finalist for Arizona State. And Sean Charles, a four-time All-American here. A quick pancake there on the edge. And Smith is in trouble as Parks trying to look for the fall. Doesn't look like he's in a position to get it right now. It's Smith slithering out and avoids giving up the fall, but does give up three near fall points, so... A big five-point sequence for Parks. Back up to our feet, one-point escape. Smith tried a... Attempted a double leg there, but it was stuffed nicely by Parks. Nine to two lead here in short time. Parks with over a minute of riding time. And that's how the first period ends, 9-2. Your PA announcer, Scott Casper, trying to get the Arizona State faithful into this match. But when you're down seven points to a guy like Jamal Parks might take a little bit more than crowd noise to change the outcome here. And on the restart, still got to give Smith a lot of credit. You know, a lot of people would have said, nah, I, I don't want to wrestle this. It's, it's too short notice. Got to make weight in short time. Smith steps up. All the credit in the world to this young man for going out there and, for lack of a better term, getting thrown to the wolves. He's not content just to be here, though. He's actually going out there and attacking Parks. Not a whole lot of success with those attacks right now, but 
Park's one of the best in the nation at this weight class. Kind of stating the obvious there as he was an All-American last year at this weight. Park's going to kick Smith out for now a 9-3 lead as the one-point escape for Smith. Arizona State sporting a new look this year as the school changed their mascot. So you don't see Sparky the Sun Devil around much anymore. Going with more of a the pitchfork theme there. Very few changes over the years for Oklahoma State's color scheme. It's orange, black, and white, and Pistol Pete everywhere. Head fake for Smith. Now Parks trying to get control on the edge. No control just yet. Parks looking for a cradle. Knowing where the out of bounds line is, keeping that clock moving. Parks cannot convert on that attempt. Come back to the center, still a 9-3 lead. 38 seconds remaining here in period number two. 149 pounds. Jamal Parks and Joel Smith here at the All-Star Classic. You know, 149. Quick shot by Parks. Quick drag. Another takedown. Now it's a major decision and working. They're building to try to extend that lead. 11-3. Under 20 to go here in period two. That riding time up over two minutes. And we'll restart with eight seconds remaining. And Park's going to hang on the end of the period with an 11-3 lead. Going into the third, and he will quickly point down. Didn't even need to look over to Zach Esposito to make his decision. Some wrestlers just know when they're going to start in the down position. Tall task for the redshirt freshman from Lawrenceville, Georgia. Not even going to hold down Parks. Another escape, so that'll be 12-3 now for Parks. Just under two minutes remaining here in the match at 149 pounds. Smith faked a super duck. Smith on the attack, quick snap and spin. Will go behind for Parks. Another takedown now 14 to three. And Smith's still going out there and making some attempts. Parks is going to give Smith the escape for one, so now 14 to four. And that is the rule change this year. Very similar to what happened in high school a couple years ago where you can just tell the official, I want to go up, and you grant your opponent an escape without going to the starting position. 14 to four. Riding time is assured at this moment, so. Will be an extra point for Parks as soon as the match is completed. Parks has seen competition this year, unlike Jordan Oliver. Parks looking pretty fresh here in the late stages of this match. Smith circles back to the center with th just over 30 to go. Still attacking, looking for an angle of Smith. Again, a lot of credit to these young men for stepping up into the match. Double leg for Parks, going to finish and get two more. Now 16 to four with 20 to go. Jamal Parks. Well, it wasn't Tyler Nauman. He's still making a statement here in this match at 149. And three to go, and that'll do it. So at another point for riding time, it'll be a 17 to four 
major decision at 149 pounds. Your winner from Oklahoma State, the All-American, Jamal Parks. The major decision victory over Joel Smith of Arizona State. We'll be right back with more from the 2011 NWCA All-Star Classic on FCS.